it really does get into when we're in tune with our internal calibration and our internal frequency, everything matches to that. All the, everything that you want is tuned into the frequency that you are. What society will always do in every one of these momentum energetic currents, they will dilute the intention of the words. If, if nothing else, you can go back to Genesis and see the very first time the serpent talks to the human, to a human being and is like, are you sure that's what it means? That is the very first attack. When we lose, I'm gonna also say sovereignty of the words that we use. When everything becomes so watered down, when everything means nothing, and but yet nothing means everything, it's, it's a world of chaos and confusion. But this week, reclaiming that word king, hmm. being a king, it's all about serving. Why is this? Because when the real king comes, the real king will show everyone that what a king is, is a protector and preserver of freedom. All we know, all we've been taught, all that we even are getting shoved down our throats in every media outlet in the world right now is the sovereign who has been served and the servants and the servants and the servants and the, the sovereignty have been the ones being served. That's not what a king is. A king is a servant of all. A king is the servant. And yet who is being served by the king? It is always us. See, the king serves the warrior and the king serves the gardener so that the gardener and the warrior can go out and do the job of the gardener and the warrior. If the gardener is not sure if seed will be there tomorrow when he needs to go plant it, or if the funds will be there uh, next month when he needs to harvest, or he'll have the team support, then he's never gonna be able to do his job well. And if the warrior is unsure that the kingdom is going to be sustained when he comes back or that his wife and children are going to be safe when he goes out, he's never going to be the warrior that he's supposed to be. And it is the king that sits back and says, I have it all. I serve it all. I protect it all. I am the greatest servant of all.